When you're in work, it's very easy to forget that people who are unemployed are going through a hard time. They get into debt, they start drinking, family breakdown occurs, their self-esteem is shot. So those kind of situations emasculate people, they keep them down. When they find that actually they've got the talent to do something and they can be encouraged to discover that for themselves, they can do amazing things. And to get to that point, they need a bit of self-confidence. You know, they're fantastic, most of them, but they don't realise it yet. The first question that I ask anybody when they come in a job club is, how are you? I just want, really, to show you that I care. Yeah, Lincoln Ledger's used to do that. You go around the group and you ask everybody in turn, what have they been able to do in the last week? You've applied for a job and you've heard nothing back, or you have heard back and you didn't get it. That would get you up and running again, wouldn't it? Everybody in that room is unemployed. So you've got kindred spirits, you've got people who are experiencing the same issues you are, who are rooting for you. I've often answered the question, what do you need to start a job club? Well, you need a venue, a volunteer and the Holy Spirit. A job club is something for a church to do in terms of social action that makes the church relevant to people in their community. And it's actually showing the love of Christ to people in our communities who are going through the pain and hardship of being unemployed.